Hello, this is Kevin from Firewalls.com, and in this Firewall feature review, we discuss the Palo Alto Network's PA820. The 820, along with the 850, make up the 800 series of Palo Alto Network's rack mount firewalls. Let's take a closer look at some of this appliance's key features and benefits. Since this is our first feature review for Palo Alto Network's firewalls, let's take a step back and talk about what the company brings to the network security table. These firewalls are known as the world's first ML or machine learning powered next generation firewalls. That means they embed machine learning in the core of the firewall, which catches and blocks never before seen attacks and phishing attempts, often instantly and in line, and automates policy recommendations using behavioral analysis. Palo Alto is a network firewall leader both figuratively and literally as third-party analysis has confirmed year after year with plenty of awards in the trophy case and confirmation of high security performance. Palo Alto Networks is also well established in the network security marketplace with more than 82,000 customers in more than 150 countries and those customers routinely offer rave reviews about their products. Now let's get back to specifics with the PA820 firewall. We recommend the PA820 for up to 100 users, ideal for the security needs of a variety of mid-size and even small businesses. As I often mention in these reviews, a user is any internet connected device like a PC, printer, mobile phone, IoT device, and more, not just your expected number of employees slash guests who will be on the network. Another note I often share, when you do evaluate your needs, consider not just the number of users you have, but what they do. Power users take up more bandwidth than those who spend more time on simple, more offline applications, so adjust accordingly based on that knowledge. Also ensure your firewall throughput with services enabled matches the connection speed you get from your internet service provider as you don't want to waste the speed you're paying for. And finally, if you're hoping or expecting to expand, include that in the equation as well. Don't use your user count of today to select a firewall when you're expecting more users to join the party in the near future. Otherwise, you'll need an upgrade before you know it. Now let's discuss how this device supports the aforementioned user count with tech specs. Let's start with the speed. The most important figure is the one that takes into account of running important firewall security services. That's known as threat protection throughput. The PA820 has a threat protection throughput of 900 megabits per second, so that's just shy of gig speed, but still plenty compared to most businesses' ISP connection speed. With no services, the firewall throughput is 1.8 gigs per second. IPsec VPN throughput is 1.3 gigabits per second. Connection-wise, the PA820 can handle 128,000 concurrent connections with 8,600 new ones per second. So that's what's under the hood, but what about the physical specs? This is a 1U rack mount device. It weighs in at about 11 pounds. Because it is a rack mount firewall, the front is where most of the action is. Let's start left to right or 1 to 9 in case of this diagram. First, it's Ethernet ports, 1 through 4. Number 2 is SFP ports, 5 through 8. Next is, you guessed it, number 3 with Gigabit Ethernet ports, 9 through 12. Number 4 shows two HA or high availability ports for control and synchronization. Number 5 is a management port with number 6 right below serving as a console port. Number seven is a USB port with number eight, a micro USB port, which serves as another console port option. And finally, number nine is a series of six LED indicator lights. On the back panel are the power input, ground stud, and cooling fans. So we've talked about the firewall itself, but a firewall is just a box without security services. In case you've been wondering, by the way, Strata refers to all things network security at Palo Alto, including firewalls and their security service subscriptions. So uh, what are those subscriptions? If you're looking for a bundle pickup threat prevention, which includes antivirus, anti-spyware, vulnerability protection, built-in external dynamic lists, and the ability to identify infected hosts. Threat protection should really be your baseline with this firewall, but there are add-on options as well. 
including DNS security for full access to Palo Alto's continuously expanding DNS-based threat intelligence, complete with machine learning and advanced predictive analysis as well. URL filtering for web access control and more granular content access control based on URL categories. You can also prevent credential theft by controlling the sites to which users are allowed to submit their corporate credentials. While some wildfire services are included in the threat prevention bundle, wildfire subscription service provides enhanced services for organizations that require immediate coverage for threats, frequent wildfire signature updates, advanced file type forwarding, and the ability to upload files using the Wildfire API. What is Wildfire? It's Palo Alto's cloud-based threat analysis that detects and prevents highly evasive zero-day exploits and malware. Autofocus provides, you guessed it, visibility via a graphical analysis of firewall traffic logs. It also identifies potential risks to your network using threat intelligence from the Autofocus portal. Cortex Data Lake, previously known as the less excitingly named logging service, provides cloud-based centralized log storage and aggregation. It's required or highly recommended to support several other cloud-delivered services, including Global Protect, which provides mobility solutions and or large-scale VPN capabilities. While some aspects are available without a subscription, if you want to use advanced Global Protect features, you'll need a Global Protect license for each gateway. And IoT helps you manage and control the risk of IoT and OT devices on your network. That's Internet of Things and operational technology devices using machine learning and crowdsourced data through the cloud. There are also standard premium and platinum support options with standard falling during business hours only and platinum providing the fastest response times. License subscriptions are available in one, three, and five-year options for all of the above. At Firewalls.com, we have a team of certified network engineers in our Indianapolis-based Security Operations Center that can ensure your security configuration is optimized when you purchase your new firewall. Our network architects implement a 100-step configuration checklist to meet your company's unique goals. Beyond the configuration, sign up for managed services to take care of ongoing device updates, reporting, remediation, and other network security needs, so you can focus on running your business knowing your network is taken care of. If you have any questions about getting started with your new PA820 firewall, contact our pros here at firewalls.com by calling 866-403-5305 or by emailing sales at firewalls.com. As a subscriber to our channel, you get first access to videos like these along with product deep dives, podcasts, how-tos, and more to help you optimize your network. Thanks very much, as always, for watching, liking, commenting, and subscribing. See ya!